Hello there, I'm Eddie Papi and welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna take a look at the Harvest, the new announcement from PoE, from Path of Exile. Um, I've been playing this game for a while. I think I'm just got over 2,000 hours, just at least. And uh, last night, for me, was uh, 11 p.m. Uh, the new leak was announced. The name is Harvest. It's blue. You can't fuck up a blue color, GGG, please. It's a sin if you fuck up a blue color, you know. Please, performance. Chris, beg you, performance. Not at the launch, but the next day. Please. Okay. Uh, okay, so we get back to this, and um, it was really late for me. I was really fucked up last night. I'm sorry. Uh, I, I, I was working. I came up at work. I started streaming, and when it got to 11 o'clock, I was actually trashed. Out. My eyes was closing. The last time I did the, the reaction, it was yeah, I felt terrible. I looked like I was dying inside. I was literally dying inside last night. So I literally just disconnected my Discord, my Twitter, my everything. I didn't get anything spoiled. I didn't see anything till today, till now. This is, I'm, I know the name of Harvest because I opened it before the stream. I'm actually streaming on Twitch right now. And this is, then it's, it's easier for me to record it here and just um, edit it later and just get it on YouTube. So we're going to take a look. We're going to, I think we're going to look at the trailer first because I'm more hyped. Let's please, let me hype, be hype. Give me something. Give me something. I want to see it. Why is the why is it on Vimeo? Are you serious? Okay, can we go to YouTube? Yeah, we can go to YouTube. Let's make this sound. I hope it sounds alright for you guys, because it sounds a little low for me. Let's just gonna take a look. That's just what you have to do. With if you like something, do this before you watch the video. Let's go full screen. Let's go and have a look. Though this land is shrouded in pain and darkness, it teems with life. I hope it's not so loud for you guys. I'll edit it. Behold the sacred grove. It's definitely louder than my mic. What we got here? Forethought, we make a weapon, dude. Life to our will to remake the world as we see fit. But beware, nature protects it. Fuck that lightning looks cool, dude. So basically. That's kind of cool. That reminds me of. I was gonna say that reminds me of synthesis, but never mind. This is actually fucking synthesis, and that tower defense of blight we had. But do not forget, whatever you sow, you must harvest. Did 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 she didn't see my stashes? She didn't see my stashes. Seek out the seed cache in every God is talking. Explore. Take its seeds through Oshabi's portal to the sacred grove. Sow those seeds to grow dangerous and rewarding monsters. When they are ready for harvest, slaughter them and extract their life force. What do you mean when they're ready for harvest? How long does it take for them to harvest? Blue mods? What's the yellow? The yellow is probably... Also, the yellow are the rares, the blues are the blues, the magic, and the... I guess the purple are the... The rare ones. The unique ones, sorry. Store the leftover life force to fertilize higher tiers of seeds. We gardening now, bro! That... that... I... Discover rare that looks beautiful, by the way. Crafting options or dangerous in-game bosses. In addition to many new items and skills, this nice expansion build, also contains major revamps to the passive skill tree, war cries, slam skills, brands, Wait. and over 50 unique items. Wait. The harvest begins on June 9th. Uh, 
Don't mind the first one. Don't mind the first one. Don't mind that. Nice. What's the next? What's the next build? This expansion also contains major revamps. What is that? Fucking Windows. I'm sorry. What is that? One, two. That's a six link. Is is six link there as well? What is that skill? The passive skill tree, war cries, slam skills, brands, and over fifty unique items. Man, it looks cool, bro. June 19. Okay, that dude looks cool. Nice MTX. I'm proud they actually start putting MTX on this. Like a, looking like a hobo in, a, in an intro video of the league. Come on, bro. That looks insane. That melee looks insane. That's a nice shot. Is that it? Wait. It's major revamps. Is this skill? That's a new aura there, right? That purple. Next to uh, on the T. Maybe not, but the top right. The right click of the mouse. What is that? The passive skill tree, war cries, slam skills. If anyone knows what is that, if that's already exists, please let me know in the comments. The harvest begins on June 19. I can't wait. Oh, it actually looks cool. But I have a doubt this is gonna be a performance league. That doesn't look like a performance league at all. And I wonder, like, my question is, how long is it actually gonna take to, for them to, to grow? As you plant the seed, how long do you like plant, then go kill the map? And you go back to it, or what the fuck do you do? I guess we're gonna have to find out. Okay, let's get, just get back to the forum. I want to see um, the notes. Let's take the notes. Okay. Click to read. Um, okay. I mean, this is basically what the guy just said. I think it's Chris, right? It's Chris announcing it. Am I mistaken? The voice. In Path of Exile Harvest, a shabby is cultivated in the Sacred Grove, an ancient garden. Yeah, that's basically just what he said. The Sacred Grove. It is beautiful. Yay! It's it believed to be older than the Eternal Empire, Ondel and Val. And I'm not sure, but it does not look like they work. I'd like to believe it's a work of ancestor as Mary. It was once blessed with a deep connection to the land. It would speak to me and nourish me, but the connection was severe. And it turned my tribe severe, the connections to me. Who, read, who wrote this? I can't read this. I'm gonna break. I'm, my English is not this good. I was alone, lost. The land spoke no more until I found this place, or shabby. Right, we're gonna get a new master, I guess. Plant potent seeds, seek out the seed, catch in every area, you explore, take the seeds through a shabby's portal to the sacred grove. Some of the seeds to grow dangerous and rewarding monsters. So it's not in the map. That's great. Okay. That is good. That is good. Rare higher tier ones require more carefully planning, but yield more value. Well, oh, this is gonna be so clusterfucked. Oh my god. Oh. Destruct the life force. When your monsters are ready for harvest, slaughter them and claim the life force. Every enemy you find in the sacred grove is one you'll intentionally plan. Customize your combat around your character's capabilities and what rewards you were seeking. So it's basically like another map system. Great. This is what I, this is what I'm hyped about.
turn in in red. Oh, man, it's a rare item with a new a new physical modifier. Replaces a cold modifier with an equivalent fire modifier. You know that the lightning usually drops. I change the stack of oils into another random stack of oils. Uh, please explain me how this is not the synthesis because it doesn't add, add the modifiers. It's a nice bench, though. I don't know. Minus 1% to this value when used. Great. That is great. And my OBS is, yes, my OBS is fine. Condense six life forages. 10 minus one, minus six life forages. Evolve your garden. As you build the ultimate garden, you discover exotic seeds with specific needs that must be met in order to grow. Where you Various pipes, condensers, and this dispersers. I don't. I don't know how to read that. I'm sorry. Can help you fertilize the garden with any remaining life force. That's great. That, this is this is what I'm not happy about. Encourages growth. I mean, life force. Those condensed life force. Extract them. Okay. Yeah. On Earth, legendary force. That actually looks insane. Can I get that? GGG, would you mind sending me that for wallpaper on my PC? That looks insane. That is actually looked insane. Shabby speaks to the legend of the three primordial beasts. Oh, so it's not the difficulty, it's actually the, the a different. Essie, Janna, and Namarim. Alright, hey, hey, we can pronounce the names. Great. Plus one. For those able to cultivate rare, uh, these rare seeds, the immense monster that emerged can yield harvest most valuable rewards. Yeah, okay. Passes. Skill tree improvements. The passive skill tree has received many improvements, including better support for some mechanics. For example, 200 weapons or, or rage, with both numeric buffs and entirely new clusters of passives. In addition, great, you kind of have to learn the, the tree again. Like, this game just keep popping shit out to learn. My RAM needs to. Can, can I get CC clearing for my brain? There's many new notable keystone passive. Thank fuck for guys and POB, by the way. Whoever made POB, dude, you deserve to work for them. Fun for fire from timeless jewels and even some entire new ones. Great. But they should. They didn't switch casters. That's great. Violent slams. As part of 200 weapons improvement, several melee skills have been recategorized re re as slams. We <laughs> Slammy slam. We introduced a new slam skill and support jam. We also revamped se several existing slams with the new. I just like. It does notice that I like saying slam. With the new visual effect, improved functionality, and greater power of 200 weapon users. First of World Support, Fist of World, oh shit, I can't read. An ancestor appears above your character to perform a slam in a new than you every second. This causes the slam to do more damage and increase diaphragm weight. I wonder what level this is. Is this the new, uh, 
What's it called? Ancestral support? Ah, that actually looks cool. Tectonic slam. Now this is nice. Now only consumes one endurance charge for every third use, making it easier to maintain your endurance charges. You now gain more area effect per endurance charge. Uh huh. There is no text on this. It's windy outside. Can we notice anything different? This is... Earthquake? Meh. Meta, by the way. I don't even know what I'm gonna play next league. If deepening Warcrys. We added the four new Warcry skills in work that existing ones. Warcry is now scale based on the power of nearby enemies rather than quantity. That sounds like a nerf. Depending like better for single target? Worse for clearing? Many workers also exert exert your attacks, increasing the power for a power for a number of attacks. That's great. Seismic cry releases a shockwave with taunts enemies and can knock them back, and also grants a boot that makes it easier to stun enemies. The buff also exerts your next few attacks. These exerts attacks deal more damage and area of effect than normal attacks, becoming progressively more powerful with each, each attack. So that's a basically a new a new line of crit. That's what it is, with a proc on top of it. Nice. Brilliant cry, that's a rework. Releases a shockwave which taunts enemies and no longer regenerates mana but now grants a percentage of your weapon damage to each of your allies based on the power of nearby enemies. It also causes your next few attacks to become excessively, yeah, we, we know what that does. Uh, and once again we don't have a text. That's a huge AoE! Lethal Brands. Never mind! I know what I'm playing next league! Fuck! Mm, sorry. Fuck that! Oh no 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 no! We have a winner. We've introduced these new brands. One brand support gem and have revamped existing brands. Oh no 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 no! We made brands a lot more versatile while also reviewing how the core mechanic works. Brand recall no longer region supreme reigns supreme, but it also uses two alongside many new options. Oh no! What the fuck did you do to the brand recall? Do not screw up brands, dude. Make them good. That's a nice skill, I like the mechanic, it's very nice clear speed, it's very nice for bossing, it's a very nice starting skill. It's Pinnacle Brand. Yes, they have brands. When placed on the ground, Penance Brand will attack to nearby enemies and become active. The heat energy builds up and spreads additional nearby energy each time it activates, quickly dividing and spreading between enemies when the brand is removed, the energy on each enemy is rapidly released in a series of explosions. I know, sounds kind of charging brands. I saw a chaos one. Please give me a count. That's not a chaos one. Arcanus brand. When placed on the ground, Arcanus brand will atta attach to a nearby enemy and. Be and begin triggering like linked spells in a s Hello there! Hello there! That actually sounds insane! Linked spells! 
Will there be a limit? Does Curses count a spell? Please let me put more than one. Please make this is gonna be fucking nice. I can get an arc, a temp chain. I don't even know, bro. I'm gonna think this through. That actually sounds insane. That is great. Isn't is this the, the like like the spell slinger, but with brands? That actually sounds fucking insane, I'm sorry. For my swearing. Dude. That's really nice. I like that. Oh. That's Fireball. The multi-proj, right? In the brand. But not the multi-proj, the... Um, is it... No. But it, it's something like that. Multi pro. No, it's, it's not actually multi pro. It fires three projectiles from a side. I can't remember the name, sorry. Oh, I'm, I'm hyped for this one. I'm actually hyped for this one. This is going to be a nice build. There's going to be some really nice builds with this. If the changes. To Herald is not that severe, and you can still probably run like, run like free, free Heralds or the AoEs. This is gonna be insane. Massive unique items, dude! What do you mean massive? Overall. 12 new unique items and we're working over 50 existing ones. Massive. Top of string. Lightning rest, very lightning damage, chance to shock. Herald of Thunder also creates a storm when you shock an enemy, excuse me? Herald of Thunder storms hit enemy with increased frequency? Take 20. You take it? You take 250? Oof, lightning dude. Chance to shock yourself as well. Doriani's prototype. Armor energy shield. That's some nice armor on that. Life, deal no lightning damage. Armor and also applies to lightning damage taken from hits. Lightning resistance does not affect affect lightning damage. Take oh shit! And by enemy, you have lightning resistance equal to yours. Uh huh. Wait, this is a rework. Is the game is the new one? I'm gonna have to look at the old item by the way. This is a rework too. What level is this? 28. Who would want a fucking level 28? Drop shot ground when moving last in two seconds. It's 28 with 15 movement speed and he has 14 energy shield. Because armor at that level is probably worth nothing. Eh. Delirium in the core game. Okay. We knew the cluster jewels would stay and they are fucking insane. Into the core path of exile experience because delirium stack with other league mechanics to make them more difficult and reward them the chance of encountering right. Yeah, we know that. Uh, alpha farming and number of the league mechanics in the area great new Vulcan renderer yeah 
I've got to try that out. I haven't tried that. Harvest supporter pack. Like, all the details are going to come up, right? No. Nope. Malice. That looks cool. The weapon looks insane. Hmm. Okay. I hope they don't look like that in the game because I'm looking them very blurry. Please tell me you're still working on them wings. Oh, please tell me this is just like a bad 3D model and it looks different in the game. Oh my god. I love it. I like it, but the wings look horrible. The textures are horrible. They're really nice. I, the wings sold. They actually sold. I'm gonna get them wings, but the texture looks horrible. Hmm. Okay, I think that's it. That is it. So it's a 28 minute. I'm probably not gonna edit it. So sorry, guys. And. Um, if you liked it, leave a like down. Remember to catch me on Twitch. I'm streaming usually every day around 8 to 9 p.m. Central East time. So UE time, Europe. You're going to catch me there playing WoW. I've been grinding WoW for three weeks. I'm hitting the last, uh, last levels in that. But it's another game. If you want to come by, come by there. If you want to comment down the video, just leave a comment what you think about the the video and uh, the announcement and i'll see you guys around the poe and remember to stay stay in exiles thank you peace